Welcome back to the channel, fam. Welcome back to the channel. It's Brian, the introverted marketer, and it ain't hard to tell. It's simple, fam. Now, today we're back on AppSumo, and we're checking out this tool called BizReply. Now, one thing you got to know is that when you're trying to do business online, presence is so important. But for me, I mainly choose threads because it works for me. I seek to connect with real humans and I invest a lot of time and effort in doing that. I do these videos for you guys. I have a community that I'm tapped in with on Substack, and that's really it. But what BizReply offers is something that I think is very useful. And I'll show you what I'm talking about here. So it enables you to be able to track keyword mentions and engage on different social media platforms. As you can see here, Reddit, LinkedIn, X, which is formerly Twitter, Quora, TikTok, Pinterest, Instagram, Facebook. So you'll be able to see what people is talking about based on keywords without actually having to manually scroll. And you can have an agency PDF or port builder and it'll go out there, create the port for you. And we're gonna go through all of that today. So you can see firsthand what BizReply can actually do and how it can help you. Now, one thing it does offer is the ability to connect your API. I use Strico, but also have Open Router and create your replies in AI if that's what you do. But we'll discuss that more as we go through and here's a, a, a unique thing right here so you have a prompt library and a prompt generator for ai responses and for multiple languages you can put in your description for your your brand and how you want to write so when you engage in certain platforms it'll reply in the way that you would speak by using ai and we'll take a look at that and see how it's working so it's relatively affordable for the price of $69. You'll have five keywords tracked, 200 AI replies per month, and about 50,000 one-time mentions. And the thing about the mentions, it is one time, but if you get in on a lifetime deal, which I did some time ago, I believe the price point to re-up to get more mentions is about five bucks. And the next tier is 149 and the last tier is 289 and you get the client report builder on the highest tier. Now, little transparency, I am on the highest tier and I did not buy it from AppSumo. I purchased it from the BizReply people specifically when they was running a lifetime deal on their website. Okay. So as you can see, they have a few five-star reviews. But let's actually check out the website. So here we are. Here's the website and here's the link. Right here going to AppSumo. They're advertising it on their website. So pretty much the same thing. Just on the website. Just want to show you guys how it's looking. And then we'll log into the back office and we'll see how it looks. And we'll try out some of these features. Now, they also have monthly plans if you choose. And pretty much it lines up one to one, just about with uh, the AppSumo plans. Almost. So for $59, you would have five keywords track, $99, $25. And the agency plan is pretty much everything. Same 25 keywords, but you also get the client report builder. And here we are. For the mentions, it's about $5 for 2,000 mentions and $5 for 200 PDF pages. So pretty affordable if you need more mentions. And the initial amount that they give you is relatively generous, in my opinion. They have some of their users' comments or feedbacks, some use cases. And they have a 30 day money back guarantee. 
All right, so with that being said, let's go ahead and log in and take a look at BizReply and see what we're looking at. One second, family. Credentials is not working. Let's see if I can log in with Google. And that's not it. So we're just going to pause this video and I'm going to be right back and figure out what's the issue. So stand by, family. Okay, family, we're back. Sorry about that. Apparently, my password was a bit outdated. I had to reset the password. But as you can see, I'm locked in. My replies are unlimited. Keywords 99 out of 100 and projects 19 out of 20. So you may be wondering why my keywords is a little bit higher than what they have on AppSumo. Well, actually, scratch that. It's because I'm on tier three. 100 keywords are tracked. What I did buy, once again, this particular lifetime deal from Biz Reply themselves prior to them going to AppSumo. But moving along, this is a project that I was working on for my old website, right? And this is something new, family, because they actually didn't have threads before. And one thing I will say, fam, threads is quickly and very, 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 I said quickly already, rising to the top in terms of relevancy i use it all the time to connect with real people so this is definitely a platform you want to connect with if you're seeking to engage with people without having to scroll you can just put in certain keywords and connect with people i actually may incorporate this into my own strategy because i use threads anyway but now i could just target keywords and I think that'll actually be more beneficial using that for me. But enough about that. So as you can see, we have YouTube, which wasn't here before. That's also new. So this platform has actually improved from the first time that I used it. So for my project, I was tracking the keyword introvert just to test it out. I wasn't really doing anything with it. I am an introvert, Brian, the introverted marketer. And as you can see, Whatever is mentioned on Reddit using the keyword introvert, it shows me where, the date, the time, and I could just generate a reply. I can, re I can view the post, whatever I need to do. Let's just say we just, and one thing, I believe you need to have your accounts connected. To, well, you do have to have your accounts connected to reply, and I do have accounts for all of these but I primarily use threads. So you can see Twitter, and then we have Quora, Facebook, Instagram, TikTok. They even have some that just came up yesterday. Today is the 16th as the recording of the video. LinkedIn, Pinterest, and my favorite, Threads. And of course, we all love YouTube. So pretty much you type in your keyword and I have my prompt and my project and my keyword was introvert business. So we're good to go from there. But sorry about that family. We're good to go from there. And then we go into advanced settings. It could sh in advanced settings, it'll show you how often the fetch posts. I have mine in every day. The number of posts to fetch on each request, I have it at 100. In auto fetching, I have it to on. But honestly, I'm probably going to turn a lot of these off, except for maybe TikTok and Threads, because TikTok is a platform I'm interested in engaging in, and also maybe Reddit. And for the autoresponder rather auto reply i had i'm using my strico api but if you have open uh if you have open ai 
you can put plug in that API as well. I believe Gemini they have as well. And you can see that Strico is there. That's what I'm using. And they have Open Router, which I also have. And what else do they have? I believe that's it. Oh, of course they have Claude. So you have Claude, you have Open Router, you have Gemini, you have OpenAI, and you have Strico. So whatever API you want to use, you can use it. Now, without an API, you will have to manually generate your replies. So let's just see what generating the reply would look like. I actually engage manually. Sometimes I use AI to do some polishing sometimes. But let's just see. We'll just use an example right here. It's already on YouTube. So we'll hit generate reply. And we'll just let that do its thing. And as you can see, it reads the the content. It generates a, a realistic reply. And you can go from there. I advise you to edit it. I also, if you're going to use this feature, make sure that you go and actually read the post and actually understand what's going on and don't just use AI replies. Part of the reason people are having issues with AI is because people are just using it to do anything instead of using it with actual care but that's just my opinion on the matter and then you can go from there if you choose all right so I just wanted to show you that briefly go over the prompts so here are prompts where you can put in prompts for how you want the actual AI to generate replies for you I have about three I have one for myself, and I have one for default social media problems, which I believe has already came with this, and authentic communication. You can just put in your prompt, the description, how it should respond, the tone, the language, and the character, and it, it, you can go from there. Makes it everything super simple if you just want to be able to generate your prompt, generate your replies literally on the fly. I don't have any save replies because I haven't really been using it to reply to anybody just yet. And then we also have reports, which I showed you that feature already. And what that what you could do with that is once you've actually been engaging and rather have all the information of the dimensions and things like that, you can download, you can create a report that you can download. Okay, what else is there? Some email. Probably gonna change that. As you can see, I'm on a lifetime plan. And I have I've had this for quite a while and I still have this many mentions left. So the mentions they give you up front is very, very generous. Even having going at a hundred per day, which is not a lot. Specifically because I'm covering so many platforms, I still have this many left. So I'm probably going to take down some platforms, uh, change the keyword, and focus on the platforms that I actually do want to engage in, which would be, as I said, threads in um, TikTok and possibly Reddit. All right. So I believe that's it for this video. Do I recommend bizreply.co? Absolutely, 100%, and here's why. It saves you so much time. You can just put in a keyword in any platform that you wanna engage with. You're able to go out there and engage and find posts related to that keyword. If you're trying to promote your business, it makes things very simple. Instead of just manually looking, you could just type in the keyword and you have access to all these platforms with ease. So if you're interested in this, the link is going to be in the description below. So you can go and check it out on AppSumo. Check out the website. If anything, drop a comment below and let me know what you think about Bez Reply. If you want me to do another video on Bez Reply, just let me know. But with that being said, this is Brian, the introverted marketer, and it ain't hard to tell. It's simple.
I'll see you on the next video, fam. Peace.